the text and sticker you see following these people around was done using motion tracking. In this video, I'll show you how to do motion tracking in CapCut PC. Let's get started. All right, so I have my video in my media library. I'll just first of all drag it down to this timeline. So you see it's a video of a woman and her son moving beside a pool. I'll move over to text and drag the default text downward. I want to stretch the text for the entire duration of the video. So I'll just click on the side of the text and stretch to the end of the video. Thereafter, I want to resize my text and place it directly on top of the woman. You can place it wherever you want. Just use the corners of the text to resize it. So let's just resize it like this and place it directly above her. You can place it beside, you can place it downward, you can place it anywhere you want. So let's just place it above her and I'll move over to this top right corner right and change the default text to mother. Make sure the text remains selected in the timeline and move over to tracking at the top right corner. Then click on motion tracking. As we are at the beginning of the video, we could choose to just track it forward. But let me just leave it at both as it makes no difference. I just want to keep the same text size for the entire duration of the video. So I will just uncheck these options so you can play around to see what works for you. Now, after that, move this yellow box right here to your subject. You have the option to change it to circular tracking by clicking on this option right here. Of course, if you want to track something circular, you can use that option. I will just leave it at box. Then you can use this edges to increase the size of your tracking area. So I'll just thereafter move this tracking area, this yellow tracking area to the subject right here. Once we are there, I'll just click on this start. So CapCut will automatically analyze the movement of the subject. And now we have our results. If I replay this video, you will notice that it tracks the subject for the entire duration of the video. So you can repeat the same process for the sun and get the same results. As for the sticker, the process is pretty much the same. Just drag the sticker down to the timeline from the sticker section, then just rotate your sticker and adjust it the way you want. So let's say I'll just place it like this, pointing at the subject. Then I also want to extend the length of the sticker for the entire duration of the video. Make sure the sticker remains selected. Move over to motion tracking. It's the same process. Uncheck these two options. I'll drag this yellow tracking area over the subject. Adjust it accordingly. I'll click on start. So it's pretty much the same process. It tracks the subject around and you get this result. So that's how to do motion tracking in CapCut. Drop a like if you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you next time.